Hola mis amigos! So I've been doing some amazing detoxing lately and I'm feeling a lot lighter and cleaner and clearer and I wanted to share some of these things with you um, to hopefully inspire you to start cleaning out your body, start cleaning out your environment and your life and really thinking about our physical bodies as these are our vehicles. This is the one body that we have to take care of. You can't trade it in later. So take really good care of it now. Keep it super pure and clean so that all of the good energies can come through and so that your soul can express itself the way that it wants to. So what I've been doing that's helping a lot, neti pot. I love this thing. Honestly, you don't even know what breathing is like until you've done this. So basically, you fill it up with warm salt water and gently put it in one nostril and then all this junk comes out the other nostril. It's like all that stagnant mucus and bacteria and debris that's just sitting there clogging up your body's drainage system. So by doing that, you watch it all go out and then afterwards you're like, oh my god. Like you feel like you can just, like you've never breathed before and that you feel this area and so much tension has been released and it's so amazing. I highly recommend this. Um, if you're a big traveler, I would get like a little plastic one like this. It's a lot lighter and less inconvenient to travel with than something more fragile like that. Um, the other thing that I did was I got a colonic. So essentially what that is, is they stick this little tube up your backside, behind, and it's flushing out your colon, flushing out the junk in the trunk. And honestly, that was like the best decision I ever made to get one. It was so great. I did this a couple years ago when I had really bad acne and it literally cleared up my acne that I had for a year from doing the colonic. The reason why I had the acne was because my body was detoxing at a rate that it couldn't keep up with. My colon and kidneys were overburdened because there were so many toxins because I, I really didn't take good care of my body over the years. I did a lot of gluten, dairy, alcohol, sugar, processed food, pharmaceutical drugs, all that jazz. So I had a lot to clear out. So for me, it was so much that it was coming out on my skin. Once I freed up my colon with the colonics, it could flow through that way and it was amazing. And now I recommend it as a good maintenance thing to do. Um, you know when you need to do it. You tune in and do you feel that there's some blockages in your stomach? Are you having some digestive upsets, digestive troubles? Do you feel that there's some stagnant stuff just sitting there that could be cleared? Um, for me, I was feeling that way because I just did a parasite cleanse and I want to make sure that all the stuff that's dying off gets out. So, oh my god, that was unreal. Like, I feel so different. I feel like I lost like 20 pounds or something. Like, I just, you're watching all the junk go through this tube, like out of your body, and you don't even believe you had all this stuff in you. So, it's super amazing, but you definitely have to see the right person for that. Um, I've seen a couple different people and I only recommend actually one person that I've seen. She's here in Toronto and she's freaking amazing. She does it right. She does the Reiki and the massage on your stomach while she's doing it. And she's just, she knows how to do it. So I can give you her contact information if that's something that you feel that you need. Um, another thing I did was I got my hair did, got a little haircut and I feel so different energetically because you're just releasing that trap vibration that needs to be shed so that you can, it opens up your auric field to bringing in that new new energy. I know that there's a benefit to having long hair spiritually, but having those um, dead ends, that doesn't really help. So removing them, you find that you just, you really feel a lot better. Um, another thing that I did was I left my job and I'm feeling so much better. I mean, when you're working with people that aren't really in alignment and it's kind of stagnant energy, and you can only go so far when you're working in that kind of environment. So for me, now I'm focusing on doing my own thing, my own cooking and, and getting that to the people. And that feels amazing to be like making it and putting my love into it and doing it right with all the ingredients that I back. And it feels so good. I feel like so light and so blessed and so happy with that decision. Um, another thing, if you feel that you have to go poo, go poo, like literally get it out of your system. Don't hold it in to be polite or like wait till you get home. Like we all poo, we're all human, like 
let's just go let's get it out of our bodies rather than when you hold it in it's getting reabsorbed back in your bodies these are toxins that want to come out so they end up depositing into the weakest organs of the body and over time that's not going to be pretty down the road so it's a lot better to just get that out now do the colonics getting all the things to help our digestion like a lot of water, fiber, real whole foods, organic, because that's how we roll. So good. Voting with our dollars. Food grown with love. Love it, love it, love it. That's another big thing is avoiding toxic food and having the cleanest, purest food that you can find. And I'm hoping that you implement these tips and that they help you feel lighter and clearer and that you're able to bring in all of the good energy that you possibly can. So let me know if you have any questions or you need some guidance. Here for you. Much love.